Hey everyone, in this video, I've got the new Yeti Rode 24. This is my first hard cooler. Uh, I'll just show you a close up of it, the latches and, you know, bottom, side, strap, whatever. If you haven't seen this thing, it's a little different than the other ones. And um, we'll just try to one take it here. Set up a light so you could see it hopefully a little better. But uh, let's see how this goes. All right, so here's the front. This is the uh, gray charcoal color. They have desert sand, white, and navy. The latches are different. They latch down. This is hard. This part here is hard material. This part is the flexible part. You can bend it a little bit. It's about the uh, consistency of their regular latches. It's got a seal, just like just like the other hard coolers. I was editing and I realized that the um, shot of the lid couldn't see it. So this is what the seal looks like. And uh, they've doubled it over right here and just kind of heat welded it or whatever. I assume they're all like that. I mentioned this is my first hard cooler. This is my first hard Yeti cooler. All my coolers so far have just been the soft cooler. So this is my first, uh, my first hard Yeti cooler. Anyway, I didn't want to jip you on the close-up view of the seal. And while I've got the, uh, while I've got the camera in my hand here, this is what the latches look like close up. So there you go. And uh, it's pretty deep. You can stick a bottle of wine in here. Uh, let's go get a. Um, let's go get some ice packs and see if they designed it to fit any particular ice pack. Got a few of these. I'm gonna have to go inside if it's a different size. But well, how do you like that? I bet it fits two of these perfectly. Hold on. Let me go get one. All right, got one out of the freezer. One, two, there you go. Perfectly. And if you don't know this, um, if you stick them in the bottom, they keep everything cold all day. If you try to stagger them through your food, they don't really work as designed. I didn't know that until a Yeti rep, until I actually complained about them. I said, you know, these things don't work for shit. And uh, the Yeti rep said, well, where do you put them in your cooler? And I said, I put them all over the place. He said, quit doing that. Put them only in the bottom, put your drinks on the bottom, and then put your food on top. Everything will stay cold all day. And he was right. There is a future basket kit that comes with this. It wasn't available yet, but you can put baskets in here to stick your, you know, fruit or sandwiches in. And the baskets sit right in this lip, I think. I will for sure get them when they come out. Anyway, this is what the side looks like. Oh, by the way, I did want to mention this is a, like a metallic sticker. I wish they would kind of embed that, embed that in the plastic, but they don't. All right, the side has, uh, you can see the strap. It's a thick, I mean, this is a no kidding nylon strap. It's double thick. It doesn't, you can't separate it, but you can tell that it's, uh, twice as thick as your average nylon wrap. And then uh, this swivels around this hub, which has a hole in it that you can anchor this down. And you know, if I didn't have a, uh, I've got a, I've got a uh, pretty badass ca uh, casting platform and uh, you know, fighting chair up there. If I didn't have that, I know for sure I would stick one of these coolers up there. I'd, I'd get some extra storage space or cooler space, and it would, uh, you could easily stand on this. On a small skiff, this is, in my opinion, some people might think this is too small if, you, if you're if you retarded and you can't balance. Uh, for my, 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 this is perfect, perfect size for a small skiff casting platform up in the front. Um, I've got these uh, two holes here, which I, I assume this is where they injected the foam. 
Um, here's the back of the cooler, super beefy hinge uh, with the, the rod that goes all the way through it. Here's the other side. And here's the bottom. Yeah, you can see the whole thing. And the feet are super beefy. And it's got this uh, right here. I don't know what that's for. Maybe it's to grab it. I bet it's to grab it if you're if you need to get some some uh, finger underneath it. That's kind of neat. It's nowhere else. Anyway, that is a look. Oh, the only thing I didn't show you was the handle. So this handle, you could actually remove it if you wanted to. If you didn't want, if you just wanted to carry it on your shoulder and you didn't want this hard strap, you could probably also just slide it down. Uh, but I'm going to dump my coffee here in a second. Mm. God, I love coffee. Um, anyway, the handle is... Uh, is fine, you know, it's, it's just a nice handle. It is, it is nice that they made it removable, in case you were wondering. All right, well, there you go. There's your up close look at the new Yeti Roadie 24 in charcoal. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.